A British toddler has had her hearing restored after becoming the first person in the world to take part in a pioneering gene therapy trial. It was sponsored by an American company. CBS News correspondent Lee Canary has the story from London. It was done. For Opal Sandy, an 18-month-old girl in England, life just got a lot louder. Yeah. Opal was born with a rare genetic condition that made her completely deaf. But her parents, Joe and James Sandy, were invited to take part in a global gene therapy trial. To potentially make obstacles easier for her to overcome was a risk definitely worth taking. Opal received an infusion in one ear, containing a working copy of the faulty DNA Opal was born with. Just four weeks after the procedure, her parents saw this. Absolutely mind blowing. I'm not sure I believed it at the start. I think Get I my phone said, out. said it was a, just a fluke. But a fluke, it was not. Six months later, doctors confirmed Opal had near normal hearing. Professor Manahar Bance is Opal's surgeon. What was your reaction when you heard that it worked? I really was a bit flabbergasted because I, we all expected in theory it to work, but to see it in practice, to see the actual audiogram and see it responding, it was a bit unreal um, and, and very joyful. The trial is sponsored by American biotech company Regeneron and is recruiting more young patients in the U.S. Hiya, Ladybug. Opal Sandy may not know she's become part of a major medical breakthrough, but now knows the sound of her mother's voice. <laughs> Mommy kiss? Lee Canary, CBS News, London. Oh, that's so sweet. Now, other similar trials looking into gene therapies as a way to restore hearing in children with deaf deafness are taking place around the world, including in America. The doctor said the earlier that deafness in a child is detected, the higher the likelihood they could benefit from a treatment like this.